You might, could I ask you just to turn that off, please? Mm, I don't think so. No. Thank yeah, you. The biologist who you're aware of yeah. has already been in here and he's marked. That's yeah. right. And right. Then we have this, this map. We That's why we've chosen right here mm -hmm. is because this is where the nests are. And, and this is what we're here to yep. protect. And we heard from IT that they've got a nest guy coming in and we just want to make sure that they see because their track record is that the biologist shows them the nests and they say, oh, we can't find them. So it's we want to make sure. They're marked. Yeah, yeah it's marked with a big sure. T to take. We yes. want to film and make sure the that they see. The one with the nest in it. That they're there. So they should not be logging here anyhow, so this should be no problem for us to be sitting here with these birds. We're here to they wait to show the, the, the IT bird rep that these are the nests. Yeah. Well, I do have Andrew's latest um, information he sent me yesterday, yeah. uh, so I've got it. Uh, one of our GIS people looking at it. Um, we're over on. We're, you know, started pretty early this morning, so I was already on the boat when I when I got it. Because so. he hadn't received her confirmation. He hadn't heard back from you or anyone. No, it's because I just saw it this morning. Mm -hmm. Have you confirmed with him? You got it. Uh, yep. Yep. Yeah. I thanked him for the information. And uh, send it off to our GIS, our GIS person. Um, I understand you got four other nests or three other nests or something right here that um, you want to point out to me? Well, there's some nests in here that. Yeah, if you want to. Yep, yeah, you can see, see them. I didn't see the ones, Robert. And I'm there's one back here someplace. Do you have Robert's four. phone number? Are you the biologist? No. no. Yeah, well, well, I, well, I was just looking. I mean, I plotted the one from Andrew's map here. I mean, it's not exact GPS. It would have so, been gone. Oh. So I'm going to ask the question, do you have intention of moving or are you going to permanently block the work site? We're not we'll talk to your biologist. We're not permanently block no. no, you will no. We're just Why? here because we want to make sure we, we that... Okay. Very we, no, I'm going to ask you, are you going to block the work site or are you prepared to leave? We're going to protect these nets. I'm prepared. Okay, and okay we, we so... We logging trucks coming in here to load and uh, we need you out of the area. We would like to see that the trees uh, that have been identified as active nests are, are marked by the conservation officer, independent of your biologist. Well, so the CEO doesn't mark nests. He's not a He does. Birder. Jerry Lister. Yes. Yeah, no, I, I reviewed it with him last week. Pardon? He's not a birder. He has not necessarily the right qualifications until he's The conservation them. officer no. doesn't right. have the right qualifications? He takes information like we do. Anyways, our biologist will be here this afternoon. I got to ask you a question: Are you will you be vacating the work site, or are you going to block work? Are, are you going to wait until he's done before you start removing the trees? Or are you going to block the work site, no, or are you, you prepared to that leave? First before yeah. I answer, okay. No, I, I think that, I think we're done here. That's fine. Okay. I appreciate you. I'm going to go in and I'll try to find the nest in a little while. Thank you. All right, Thank cool. you. So the process will be continuing today, and. Um, all I'm doing is going to encourage you guys to respect the private property here, the equipment, and any garbage. I know the, the coffee cups and stuff that was brought in, please we'll bring it out. Okay? Of course. Absolutely. And the other thing, the smoking is very dry in here. Okay. No smoking, because you guys will be contradicting what you're trying to achieve, okay. obviously, right? All right, great. Um, so just keep that in mind. Be respectful. And like I said, the pro process is ongoing. How's everybody doing? Awesome. Good. How are you? Good. I'm just listening to the birds. Yeah. Have a good night here last night? I wasn't here. I don't oh, know. okay. <laughs> just see, nice foosball table. Mm -hmm. So who's the expert? At foosball? Yeah. So anyway, here's the plans today. We're coming in to get the machine. We're moving it off the site here. We're not going to fall any more trees right here right now. And uh, we'll be bringing logging trucks in a little bit to remove the logs that are here. Are you prepared to let the people come in and get the machinery? No answer. I assume that's a that's a yes. It's okay. They'll be in about uh, what half hour? Uh, Fifteen minutes. Five minutes. Come get the machine. Do you intend on letting them access the machine? Okay. Sure. Bring me. Okay. Thank you. Who are you, sir? My name's Wayne. I work with Island Timberland. Could you guys uh, leave the room so we can get our machine out of here?
guys please move so we can get out of here? I'm just staying here to protect the nests. Pardon me? I'm staying here to protect the nests. We're, yeah, we just want to move our machine. We're going and we're going to leave. We're not going to touch nothing. We got maintenance to do and we'd like to take our machine out of here and, and get it out of your face. As I mentioned, we're not going to be doing any more crawling here. The machine's moving off site. That's all I have to do is just let us get we're it out of here. We're going to get on the low bed and we're going to leave. So. We're not falling any more timber here. We're waiting for the results of a couple of reports that were done yesterday. Um, an inspection of the land and a bird report. The guy just moving his machine out. We're just appreciating if you let him move out. I promise you we're not falling any.